Greetings, Gator fans. I'm joined by this week's Allegheny Female Athlete of the Week, SJ Guillaume of the Allegheny Women's Cross Country Team. SJ, congratulations, and thanks for taking time out to talk to us. Oh, thanks for having me. Well, this past weekend, SJ led the Allegheny Gators at the Paul Short Invitational. She finished in the top 20 and in the top six of all Division Three runners with a personal best time of 22.06. SJ, I know it was a big field, like we said, a lot of Division One teams. How did it feel to go out there and compete against some of the bigger school people and to do so well against them? It was great. It was really great competition and a really great day, great weather. So um, it was exciting seeing how we stacked up against those schools and other D2 and D3 schools. Well, you had almost a month off between your last meet at Calvin and the Paul Short Invitation. You guys still came out and did very well as a team. Uh, what kind of training did, did you put into the Paul Short, you know, having such a long layoff? Well, a lot of it was, I think, the 5Ks leading up to it gave us some good speed. And then the workouts that we've been doing with Coach Hill, um, we've been doing a lot of kind of faster workouts. So all that definitely paid off in the you guys are ranked in the top four in the region. Your next meet is the Interregional Rumble at Oberlin, another really big meet. Uh, it'll be another one with a lot of good competition. Uh, what are your expectations going into that, and what are, what are your personal goals? Uh, well, we're staying really focused as a team for that meet. Um, it's really important for us to rank well against teams in our conference and in our region. So um, we're just aiming to do as best as we can. And um, personally, it's a really flat course, so I'd like to see a good PR again. So that's the plan. Well, good luck, and again, congratulations, and thanks for being here. As always, Gator fans, be sure to keep it locked in to AlleghenyGators.com for all of your up-to-the-minute sports news and information.